A few days ago, I released my professional level book and I can tell you that there are a lot of things that you can learn from this book. So I'm just going to go through the topics so that anyone who is interested in getting the book, you will know all the things that you will learn, all the topics. The book has over 83 pages and that's a lot for you to learn. 83 pages of log diagrams where you will learn every advanced troubleshooting by understanding log diagram circuits and what circuits are related to certain faults in a mobile PCB. So the first lesson you learn what no trigger fault is in a mobile PCB. So the first lesson is no trigger fault. We have the second we have no trigger VBAR to main power supply. So you learn the block diagram of how the VBAR is being converted to the main power supply. And as you know, like I told you guys before, this ebook you study block diagram, that's why the book name is the block diagram master. Which means that if you are studying the CQ that is converting the VBAR to the main power supply, you will learn every single thing, every single thing that is connected to that CQ. So we have the third lesson, which is no trigger secure. We have the fourth, no trigger troubleshooting stages, as you can see. And we have trigger active, no power fault. We have PMU output types. We have trigger active, no power, chapter two. We have small current trigger, no power. We have small current trigger, chapter one. We have small current trigger, chapter two, chapter three, and chapter four for small current no trigger of small current no trigger then we have current monitoring the dc power supply that's uh, topic 13 that's number 13 we have uh, six pin backlight ic circuit that's number 14 we have backlight ic circuit in a mobile pcb in display failure circuit diagrams and troubleshooting so all these topics you learn about this then you learn how to troubleshoot them you don't just understand the circuits you understand how you can test the voltages that are needed where the voltages are getting to the type of enable signal that all these circuits are getting then we have amulet touchscreen circuit we have amulet touchscreen circuit 2 we have two different types of amulet touchscreen circuit so you will get two topics on that and uh, we have no charging problem circuit chapter 1 we have battery error circuit we have Xiaomi battery detection schematic CQ. That's a very important lesson. So at number 22, we have power leakage problem related circuits. So you study all circuits that are related to power leakage fault. Sorry for my voice, I do have uh, cough. Then number 24, we have troubleshooting mobile phone camera failure. 25, we have arm reading with your USB arm meta as you learn how you can troubleshoot and tell where you have to start troubleshooting a phone by just connecting the phone to charge very important we have 26 power supply reading you learn how to use your this power supply connect your phone and tell which circuit what the problem is so that's it you can get the course send me a message on whatsapp or check the link on my bio to purchase the course it's just 25 dollars so everything that you learn here is just 25 dollars so Rush right now and get this ebook. It's very good.